recording. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight on the Jocelyn and Oliver S. for Travel Racing Show, hashtag one on YouTube. We have the guy better known as the Hollywood superstar of racing, the guy that knows how to get the crowd on their feet, and he knows how to put on one heck of a show. Tonight from Paradise, California, we have with us 24, Mr. Brody. Welcome to the show. Thank you. So, Brody, let's talk about your racing career. Where did it all start for you? Uh, my dad, I was just getting back from my um, my aunt's house, and I walked into the garage, and my dad <clears throat> was building me a race car, and I got there, and he had it all set up, and then he had me sit in it, and then um, <clears throat> that's where it all started. And then, um, <clears throat> then a couple of days later, we... Um, <clears throat> It in the garage I met in the race trailer and we went out the cycling speedway which was my first ever time racing on that track so that track's got some memories for me and I ripped around and then I believe it was my second time I went out there and I went wide open Donald got stuck right in the fence oh yeah were you a little bit scared at all after you hit the fence I mean bit- I was I was a little shook it up, but um, didn't um, they didn't get in my way or anything. So this is where I'm at now. Okay. So Brody, um, okay, how much success have you had as a race car driver? For awesome career. Like every race car driver, I'm pretty sure um, ups and downs. Um, like go to a racetrack, um, you could have a good night, bad night. There's always those nights or some. So, so I, I've had a pretty good racing career, and I'm just glad where I'm at now because of where my dad's got me. Okay. So, Brody, um, where did the 24 come from? Um, My dad, I don't know where he got it from. Um, I'm pretty sure Grandpa, um, I think Jeff Gordon maybe, um, but – I carried on the 24. My dad was number 24, and then we added a JR to my number. Okay, very cool, very cool. So, Brody, um, okay, what's your favorite thing about being a race car driver? Um, just like going fast in the race car. I love going fast, and uh, the people around racing, I love them. Friends and all of them. So, Brody, um, when it comes to your racing career, what does an awesome day at the shop look like for you? What? What does an awesome day at the race shop look like for you? Um, I don't really know. What's an awesome day at the race shop? What's an awesome day at the race shop? You lagged out, so I couldn't really hear. Um, an awesome day at the race shop is qualifying good and all of that, and um being happy and um going to the track and um winning and all of that and stuff i like a lot of people will say i i just a perfect day at the thrace track is um going there having fun and all of that like going say quick time or anything i love going quick time i love like i said going fast that's just the perfect day for me so what's a perfect day at the race shop look like for you perfect day at the race shop um helping my dad clean the cars maintaining the cars i love doing that with him um just take off tires and um yeah my brother my little brother um helps too so um i love the carry on my brother with that too so i um clean the race trailer help on the race cars and wash him so, Brody, um, with your racing career, where do you want to see yourself when you become an adult in the, in the racing world? I, I really I want, I want to race in NASCAR one day, but I'm just I'm in love with dirt and I want to be a World of Outlaw driver and a NASCAR driver, too. OK, very cool. Very cool. So, Brody, who is your racing hero? Who do you look up to as a race car driver? My dad and um. 
Kyle. Okay, okay, okay. So, um, Brody, um, what's your favorite racetrack that you've raced on? My favorite at the top, always, I've always loved this track, Red Bluff, Outlaws, that's where I won West Coast. I've always had good luck there. I love that track. And then um, my second favorite, Cycland, um, the owner, I love him. Um, um, Wool, um, Morale, I love him. He's really good um, about get, doing the track and stuff. I love that place. It's like a mini um, mini sprint car track, and it gets right up against the wall there. Okay. So, Brody, what's your least favorite track you've ever raced on? I hate just bottom tracks. Um, that's how it's been at Cycling for the past couple of weeks, but um, I still love that track. My least favorite was probably – I love that. Um, I did pretty good at that the, that big old race. Um, I didn't really like the high desert hustle trap because at first it was just right around the bottom and it's just really that it was really dusty. Okay, so Brody, um, um, okay, Brody, um, what do you like to do for fun away from the racetrack? Love baseball. Love baseball. If anything happened in the racing for me, I'd go to. Um, Baseball, that's what I do it outside. Um, I made it to All-Stars this year, so I have an All-Star practice. And uh, um, one day, I believe, so I got my first All-Star um, practice. So that's what I would do besides that. Or um, play wiffle ball, which is another thing with um, outside of baseball that I like to play with my dad. And fishing. So I am a I have a huge question for you, Brody. If yeah. you ever had the opportunity to race the Indy 500, would you do it? Yes. Would you? Yes, you would. Yes, yes, you would. Okay. Yes. Did you yes. watch the Indy 500 this year? Yes, sir. The same person that won it last year. Forgot his name, but I know he won it again. Yeah, Joseph. Newgarden. Yeah, Joseph Newgarden. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And the crazy thing is, is Brody, he started out in gold carts much like, like you pretty much did, but you started out in, in outlaw carts. He started out in pavement gold carts. Yeah. My favorite, um, actually, in the car driver is Dan Wellman. Oh, I'll tell you what, Brody. We knew we would get, we get along really good because Dan Wellman. Yeah. Well, you're kind of lagging out, so. Okay. But yeah, Dan Weldon's uh, my uh, favorite Indy car driver. Okay, am I better now? What? Okay, am I, am I better now, Brody? What? Am I better now? Okay. Okay. Yeah, so, Brody, better. um, is there any, am, I, am I better now? Yeah, you're better. Okay. So, Brody, is there is there any is there any big racing events you're looking forward to competing in this year? Um, besides West Coast, that's the big race, but, um, I don't think that was sure 2024 yet, was it? Yeah, it's 2024. Yeah, that's the only big race that I've done so far in, um, 2024. Okay, so Brody, uh, okay. Okay, now let's talk a little bit about, okay, so who do you have for sponsors on your race car, Brody? I have State Farm, Bianchi Farms, um, just a new one just got added, Who's Your Racing Tires. Um, I got Dobridge and Son, Bronze Automotive, Dobr Dobridge and Son, and um, Bianchi Farms, Factory QRC, uh, Victory Landscaping, and um, Plan B Answering Surface, and, um, and you. Okay, okay. So Brody, um, okay. So Brody, do you have any advice for kids coming up in the racing world? Um, listen to your dad. Um, if you get mad, always keep your head up. If you don't finish good in a race, keep your head up. And um, I've came from a bad weekend to um, up to um, um, good. So yeah, 
um, I had Ezra Hustle at didn't didn't I was um didn't do the best in the beginning of the um the I believe it was a four day show um four day show and then um did not give up kept my head up and I got second in the high desert hustle. Okay, so Brody, when it comes to you winning races, what's a, what's it like to be a race car driver like yourself to win races? It's fun, loving, enjoying, um, race, um, winning, and all of that. Um, if I win, we'll go. I have to make sure we have to go have a nice dinner after the day of race day. If I won. So Brody, how do you celebrate your victories? At where do I have them at? No, I said, how do you celebrate your victories? Um, ice cream, dinner. Um. Love to get on the top of the wing, and um, that's how I celebrate my wins. Okay, okay. So, Brody, I like to do something kind of spectacular for my racing show guest. Tell you what, we're going to do and invite you in on the too. So, are you ready for this, Brody? Yes. I'm going to toss the mic over to you. If you have any questions for me, go right ahead and ask away. Okay. Who's your favorite race car driver? Dan Weldon and Kyle Larson. Yep. What's your favorite dirt world of, like, where the world of outlaws go? What's your favorite track? Knoxville, Iowa, Knoxville Nationals. I knew it. Been there two years in a row, 98-99. Have you ever been the Indy 500? Never been, never been the Indy, but would love to go. That's I want to go to. I want to kiss the bricks one day. Yeah. Do you, you have any other questions for me? Um, no, I think I ran out. Okay. So, bro, do you have a racing page? What? You kind of logged out. Um, you're logging. Oh, there you go. What? Do you have a racing? Do you have a racing page that racing fans can follow you on? Yes, they do. Uh, Brody Reynolds Motorsports on Facebook. So, ladies and gentlemen, and Brody, you have Brody Reynolds. Um, I have Brody Reynolds. Um, you on YouTube? I do YouTube. Um, and um, Instagram. So go hit up Brody Reynolds Motorsports on Facebook. Go hit up Brody Reynolds Motorsports on Instagram or Brody Reynolds on Instagram, and go hit up Brody Reynolds on YouTube because this kid is a superstar, definitely. So, thank you. With that, being, with that being said, Brody, I would like to thank you for being on our show tonight, talking to us about your racing career. I will call you a little bit to thank you in person. I'm going to give a little racing news update, but I will call you a little bit to thank you in person, okay? Okay, thank you so much. Yep, thank you very much. You're welcome. Yep, I'll have you step out now, Brody, and I'll give a little racing news update. Okay. All righty. All righty, bye. 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 I'll have you have you step out. Exit. Right. I'll have you exit the Zoom. All right, bye. Yeah. Bye. Ladies and gentlemen, that was Brody Reynolds from Brody Reynolds. Order school from Paradise, California, ladies and gentlemen. So, with that being said, little racing is a you know, Marcus Armstrong in the first crash of the day, and that was pretty. Yeah, that play. And I'll tell you what, Honda had some more.
history of IndyCar. From a serious congratulations to Shell Nonsense. Um, also, definitely Ricky Thornton Jr. picked up the win at the Spencer, Iowa IMC Modified Challenge a uh, couple weeks ago. So, congratulations to Ricky Thornton Jr. Um, but with that being said, um, all racing news have seen them announced they are the so what happens there? But with that being said, gentlemen, you guys have a good night. Catch you later. On the Facebook. With that being said, gentlemen, if you would like to sponsor our show or be on a racing show, feel free to call us or text us at 712-209-7138. Have a good night. And our racing show is sponsored by Construction. Please.